So we got something cool to talk about here. So in case you guys don't know, you guys can't see it on this screen because it's not showing up on OBS or anything, but people in uh, an admin in the box for Discord server, they're basically, basically there was the innovator rewards and basically, let me stop saying basically, for each leak, for each, for each category that they win at the innovator rewards, they would release a new leak. So they won the first one and they released it. I was expecting just a picture, not a video, but I'm going to look over this with you guys and I'm going to give you my thoughts. So it starts out with number one. First thing to notice here, map looks way better. There's particles floating all around here. I don't know how to feel about the new icons, but this, I can't stress how much better this map looks. This map looks, abs this map looks great. It doesn't look like it came from 2019 anymore. It doesn't look so extremely outdated. This is a great looking map. I'm a huge fan. Next thing we have here is the Soru animation has also been reworked. It's kind of been the same for a while. So that's new. I don't know if I can slow down the video or not. I can. It looks a lot better. Way, way, way better. I think you can tell that Shafi put some touches on it because he has a very distinct style when it comes to his his VFX. Sora animation, it's simple, but it just looks way better. There's a lot more smaller details on it, and it's just way better looking. Thing that I'm so excited about, very, very excited about. I didn't see this coming. There's also a new area, D Dragon Dojo. So it looks like these new islands are also getting completely new areas. This part here. We are getting reworks to the guns. Oh my, finally. That looks, that looks great. I cannot stress how good that looks. That looks so good. It really does. Because it, it's just the visuals, they just look really well done. Everything here just looks good. And there's now uh, animations for the actual gun. So there's as custom animations, literally custom reload animations too. Uh, bow as actually animated when you're drawing it. This just looks freaking great. And there's this thing at the top. I think there's something on top of this dojo. But here's what he said here. This looks good. But here's what he said here. More changes are coming. The dragon fruit has not been their only focus. I think we guessed that, but we didn't know exactly what everything they were working on. So guns have been reworked from the ground up with enhanced mechanics and visuals. Hydra Island has been fully reimagined. The famous uh, Uzoth has built a dojo in the cliffs packed with new challenges and hidden treasures. We mastered the Dragon Talon Dojo. So it looks like the, so the Dragon uh, Talon Trainer is going to be moved from the castle, the haunted castle, all the way here to Hydra Island. And there's going to be some new things associated with it as well. It, it's possible that even Dragon Talon could also be getting a rework. It's, it's completely in the cards. And... This is only one leak. They said for each category that they won, they would post another leak. So if Block Suits wins the second one, that's I think in 11 or 12 days, we're going to see something else. And it might have to do, it's not going to do with the guns. It, there's a lot of stuff to doing this update. It might be another fruit rework on besides Dragon. But at the end here, they also say they're still saving the best for the trailer, which would obviously be Dragon rework and not just Dragon rework, probably also... They probably have the last of the sword reworks as well that we didn't get. They probably also have, they might even have accessory reworks. I don't know if that cape is part of Indra's avatar. I don't want to spread any misinformation, so I'll just give it a good look. Yeah, okay, okay. But after seeing this, I'm getting excited. I'm getting excited. It's just that you have to understand that for a long time, we were just the only leaks we were getting. All we were getting was, oh, wow, I did not even see this before. Oh, wait, this is, oh, shoot. Oh, this is the docks of Hydra Island. So these are the docks of Hydra Island. Of course, we still have like same like tangular looking trees, but we don't need like listed trees. Like th these look good enough. It just looks like there was just way more thought that went into this map now. This looks way better. This looks like an actual dock. This looks great as well. The, all the particles coming out of the trees and stuff like that. That looks great. It's still kind of the same it was before, but it's just, it's a lot less empty. There's a lot less empty space and there's, there's more things to look at. This is especially going to be fun with control because that's also more things to throw around with it. I'm sure they're working hard on it. I don't know. I heard about a copyright thing. I don't know if that made them have to 
change their plans or anything but really it's just all they really had to do was give us a leak like this give us a leak like this to just make us excited because you, you gotta like because the thing is with the leaks we've gotten in the past so far they just we all we had was this which was a bad this is good it's dragon and then dragon and then dragon and then dragon and then something else related with dragon and then dragon we got bomb but this this is way better this is definitely something uh, also the water looks a lot better this is probably where uh puzzle is for the Ishida or whatever that was but this is what i wanted to see an actual video just something just some gameplay so so basically to summarize this hydra island rework there's obviously more that are done they're just not showing us they're just showing us uh, one example so it basically shows us the map rework well an, an island rework shows us the new soru animation and then the reworked bow and as well as a new area called dragon dojo which this gives me a lot of hope for first c because that means they're gonna add more content first c and it's gonna be actually a more enjoyable to play in because first c is definitely the worst part of the game for me so the fact that first c is not gonna be the boring experience that it was before is it feels really good of course the new uh m1s now obviously there's a rework for the skills too but it said they're showing they're revealing the best for the trailer the thing is like they could have done this month two months or at least three months ago because like, they don't have to show us the best stuff they just got to show us they just got to show us that they're working then more than just on dragon because that was people's concerns but uh, i'm glad that they uh actually gave us real video to watch it's just it just feels so much better when i'm watching a little bit of gameplay instead of a picture or something it's just way better just way better this looks great this looks great i can't lie is it going to be worth the eight months that's all going to come down to the amount of content they're releasing if they're giving us they're giving us island reworks there looks like they're revamping all of the uh, revamping reworking reworking all of the guns they're giving us map reworks for all seas we are getting of course the angel divine arts fighting style new sword it might give us the last of the sword reworks uh, we have that new uh soru animation as well we probably have a few other uh, fruit reworks that we don't know about on top of dragon and then we possibly have some new islands and maybe some new sea events that's that's definitely a lot of content to look forward to that's definitely a lot of content to look forward to they said the update that's dropping after this one so this is just one update they said there's another update shortly dropping after this one so i think they're trying to prep they're working on content for a one update but then it also looks like they're kind of working ahead for a second update to release shortly after this first one which is interesting interesting i'm pretty happy about that i guess we will see uh where they go from here uh, i don't know if blocks roots is gonna win next voting they probably will although they are going against strongest battlegrounds so that's that's gonna be kind of a tough fight for them to win but people are so desperate for leaks at this point that block shoots might actually win the second category that they're going to be in. Uh, we'll just wait and see. If they do win, they might just show us some extra, so another island and something else. They got people this hyped. You just know they're probably going to get all the votes, especially when they have a pretty good incentive. They're releasing straight up videos. Yeah, people are definitely going to vote for them.